manifestations and there are little yeah. vlogs that happen, but in terms of a, a beacon or something... This is still working. Go, they don't, like, bother so me. This is great, because basically I can say anything that I want to. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hijack the interview. I need some love like I never needed love before. That's Spice Girls, actually. We are uh, a band called Wim. Uh, we are currently in the L Magazine offices in down under the Manhattan Bridge overpass, Dumbo. Our band started in 2007 when um, I had been looking for a someone to sing some songs. Martin had been looking for somebody to play some songs and a band to sing some of his to play some of his songs. Martin, we sat on the balcony one night and Martin said, I like your stuff, and I said, I like your stuff, and we got together and we started playing with Harry, and uh, before we knew it, we had Dustin and Saul, and, um, and we were with, we became with. Being here in New York and playing here in New York, uh, it's a huge like, step up in terms of where we come from in Sydney in Australia, where much smaller city, much smaller population, still a lot of good music around, a lot of talent around, but not a lot of places to really nurture it and look after it. We found there's, if there's a big tapestry, which is which is music, the scene, or whatever, in America, it's like you're very encouraged to join the tapestry. I mean, it's, it's, it's been going on for so long here. There's been so many bands, and so many individuals, and so many things. They just like get on board. In Australia, I guess, um, it's a little, maybe even a little more exclusive, but um, it, it's, that's certainly not saying that we're not be a part of the Australian tapestry as well. It's just, it's just been great to be here and be encouraged. No, everyone's not using floor toms anymore, which is good. Uh, except us. Except us. Because <laughs> we're from Australia and we're three years behind everything.
Yeah, the time.